this is the salt. So we're going to mix it now. Oh yeah, come and pour your water. This and I made the video. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Awam Kenneth and we are back for another one. If this is your first time coming to my channel, I want to implore you to subscribe. We are almost at 2,000 subscribers, so please help me reach that goal. And again, we are here for another video, but this time around, we are roasting or frying some granuts or peanuts, any terminology you want to use here. It's up to you, right? And I got my mom to help me do this. Um, show this video because um, your man cannot multitask. We can we cannot do this alone. We need some help. Okay, so the first step, as you can see, is trying to salt it. So we are doing a salted peanut or granut, right? Um, so you don't need much water. You just need something like a little bit of water to kind of like toss the peanuts in, right? So it gets that infused salty taste. So you need the water to help dissolve it in. So that's why there's water added to it. If not, if you just like spray dried salt on it, it won't be as effective. I presume. Okay, I presume. Um, it's not a fact. Uh, so my mom here is just trying to like toss it so that each peanut is evenly, you know, cared for. You know, they got the gossip of that juice. That juice. <laughs> that salt juice. Uh, the next step is to fry it or roast it, but we use today we use this um, gas burner that um, has a license from hell, hellfire. Okay, because um, this this thing burns, this thing burns. You can see like it was really burning the ground and um, the gary. So we're using cassava. <laughs> I almost said cassava flakes. <laughs> we're using cassava, um, dried processed cassava to do this. Um, locally called gari here so we're trying to like roast it in gari so the process of roasting the peanuts is you need some sort of like a medium that will help spread out the heat um evenly because the peanut is rounded it's not flat so you just kind of like toss to the other side and toss to the other side so you need it to go around the body you know um so a medium like gari or grand um let's say sand Will normally help in this instance so we decided to use gary because it's more hygienic to be honest it's really more hygienic the only bad part about the gary is that it burns it burns and the smoke it brings out like we're not prepared <laughs> we came to roast this thing and it smoke like blow with me like i'm so glad my mom was doing this because i would have stopped this video and you know given up the ghost anyway i decided how to make my camera work better with me here so that's why the quality just went high um so um we're just kind of like tossing it in you can see that the gary is changing color um from white it's turning to brown um so you're meant to do this for like 10 to 15 minutes right but naturally as nigerians just taste it when you taste it and it's good after a while you know it's done <laughs> but i think on a recipe level it's like 10 to 15 minutes um then you get normally you see the color turn from white to a little bit kind of like golden brownish and then you know it's done then just taste it to your level so people want it darker some people just want it like you know even in light um so kind of like you roasting or yeah roasting coffee coffee beans basically that's the process so you're trying to like roast it okay my dad tried using a non-stick pan to do this like so without any dairy without anything entirely just like the peanuts on its own it was almost there but you could tell that some sides were like burnt so, like some sides were burnt it's not evenly um heated okay so um she's just going to work on this for some minutes and let's see how it goes
So we are done with the process of frying with gran um, with the gari. You can see that with the gari. Okay, can I, I hear the accents? Um, so you can you can tell clearly that it went from white to brown to black, and this is it at the final look. You can tell that the peanuts now are now looking golden brown, and yeah, it's good to go. But we could not inhale the smoke any longer, and we decided to like bring it out for it to like rest. You know, rest beat and that's wholesomeness of heat okay um but for the second batch we're not going to be doing we're not going to be roasting the peanuts with um with gary any longer we're going to change to something else yeah is my dog giving you some dog cam he wanted to be on the spotlight and i was like yeah um i've forgotten the name of this dog but we move on we we move we move this is not what brought us here so for the second badge, we decided to go with, I say we, but my mom decided to go with, <laughs> to go with sand. And the sand was like washed a couple of times. I say a couple, it was washed intensely, you know, like really washed and dried out with heat. Then we proceeded to put in some peanuts to um, roast it. So the advantage of this method is the smoke, it's, the smoke is no longer there, so you don't have smoke. But the problem, yeah, eating rice, um, the problem with the sand method is uh, it's sand. And if you have like six or seven dogs in your compound, the sand is not to be trusted. Okay? And yeah, so it's not really hygienic per se. So you have to like wash it, wash it. Then when it's done, you just have to like dust it because it will come with the sand dust on it so yeah be careful with this method that is what i'll say um so the gary is a lot safer in my opinion than the sand so it makes you wonder like when you buy peanuts on the road <laughs> what did they roast it with <laughs> did they wash their sand <laughs> or did they use gary i remember gary is expensive it's really expensive so yeah that's what I'm just going to say about that. So we are done with this. Um, so remember for each process is still the normal 10 to 15 minutes or 20 minutes. Just wait till it's golden brown and you can um, do that. So right now you can taste it. But it's not good to serve this the way it's looking now because it's not dry. You want it to dry off, cool off for some minutes before you start processing it like what... Um, this lady is doing here in the video so you can see how it's looking like you know it's it's, it's sweet you know it's 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 good at this level um, the salt was not so much so it's just perfect the person responsible for this great endeavor is my dad um so dad we love you so guys we've come to the end of this um entire production and i just want to say thank you for watching so far i hope you stay to the end please remember to subscribe and like this video and also share um other than that stay safe and see you in my next one